take part in aphasia research at UCL. We would like to invite you to take part in this study. It investigates the effectiveness of a new therapy for sentence difficulties in aphasia. The project uses a new therapy for sentence difficulties in aphasia. The therapy involves practicing tasks on a computer. The project also explores if electrical stimulation over the brain boosts the effects of the therapy. Why is it important? Most people find sentences hard to understand or produce after an aphasic stroke. We want to find out if a new therapy can help difficulties understanding and producing sentences. What will it involve? You will visit Chandler House at UCL over several weeks to meet a researcher. Chandler House is in Bloomsbury within short walking distance from King's Cross St Pancras and Russell Square stations. You will participate in a new four-week therapy for aphasia. You have to come three times a week for four weeks, a total of 12 therapy sessions. The therapy with the computer involves listening to words and sentences and speaking. You will also have brain stimulation for 20 minutes in each therapy session. This technique is called transcranial direct current stimulation or TDCS. TDCS may encourage areas of brain around the stroke damage to become a little more active for a short period. For the TDCS, we will place small pen marks on your scalp and place one damp sponge containing an electrode on your scalp. The sponge is held in place with an elastic bandage. Then we put one electrode on your wrist. A very small electrical current is given to your brain. You might feel a slight tingling sensation under the electrodes. We are combining the computer therapy and TTCS to find out if brain stimulation boosts the effects or perhaps makes them last longer. Before and after therapy, we will measure your language and other abilities. You will do some tests. These include naming and describing pictures, listening to words and sentences, and using information to make decisions. We will make audio recordings of your speech. You will also have an MRI brain scan after therapy if it is safe for you to have MRI. Who is this study for? People with aphasia following a stroke at least six months ago. At least 18 years old, with English as a main language, and right-handed before the stroke. Have difficulties in understanding sentences and speaking, and able to travel to UCL for testing and therapy sessions. What are the advantages and disadvantages of taking part? There are no known side effects associated with the therapy tasks on the computer. TDCS is safe in most people. We will check that TDCS is safe for you. 
TDCS can cause slight itching or irritation, skin redness, which usually fades. There are no known medium or long-term risks of TDCS. All our testing and therapy sessions take place at UCL. You need to be willing and able to travel to UCL for your sessions. We will pay you £10 towards your expenses for each meeting. If you are interested in learning more about the study or would like to take part, please contact us using the details below.